Hey everyone, how's it going? Mark here from Santino Cigars and Cocktail, Santino Sunday Cigar View. This week on Just the Tip, we're going to talk a little bit about lighting cigars with matches and lighting cigars with Spanish cedar. Now, the first thing I want to get into when, when it comes to a match, when you have a match, especially a cigar match, the lower base of this match is cedar, the top part of that is your combustion material. When you strike a match, it's important that you let that combustion burn away. Once you start seeing the wood ignite, go ahead and start lighting your cigar. What happens is that allows you to actually light the cigar off of the cedar burning, and you're not burning through that combustion material in the top, okay? It's gonna save some flavor content, things like that. Now when it comes to cedar, simple piece of cedar, doesn't really matter how big, what you play with, don't worry, it will not stay on fire forever. But when you light a piece of cedar, it doesn't matter if you use a match, lighter, doesn't matter. You're going to treat it just like a match. Tilt it and light it. Let it start burning. What then you then do, pull it down below your cigar and just like with a lighter, you're going to pull the flame to the cigar. Now what that does, burning through that cedar, it's going to help you bring in some of these cedar notes into the cigar. It leaves off a nice, beautiful smelling essence, brings a nice, calm kind of extra flavor into the cigar. This is a sometime preferred method of lighting a cigar, simply because it's kind of one of the purest flames you can actually use to light the cigar. Once you light that cedar, you can let it burn for a second, kind of tilt it like I did. I typically like the burn to come down about an inch, an inch and a half. So you have a nice strong flame that you can pull from. A lot of times when you're pulling that flame in, if you get in too early, when you push the smoke out, you may blow out the cedar. We don't want that to happen. As I said, very popular because it does come down to one of the purest ways you can actually put a flame to the tobacco itself. The one thing I want you to be very careful with is that flame, you saw how high that flame got. Do not bring that too close to that cigar. That cigar will ignite like a matchstick. You will bring too much of the flame towards the cigar and you'll, you'll have what's called a pull away flame. When you pull the, 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 the igniter, the cedar, away from the cigar and you're drawing, you will still have a lit flame on the end of the cigar. What will then happen is you'll start seeing a burn effect that's gonna go around on the top of the wrapper. It might burn away some of the taste. It might cause the wrapper to crack. It might cause it to canoe it may just make it a little difficult to smoke. So when it comes to matches, let's remember, let the igniter burn off first. When it comes to the cedar, give yourself about an inch, inch and a half of that flame and draw right in and enjoy that. That's this week's Just the Tip.